Okay, I thought I would jump on here real quick and just um, okay, kind of do some. Jump on here real quick and just hold on. Okay, I'm gonna jump on here and do some updates. I've been really sick, so I'm so far behind. Um, I'm also preparing for my daughter's wedding, so I'm kind of taking some time off. I'm not real um, consistent with videos, so I'm sorry about that. As, uh, her wedding is on um, the 19th of this month, and then I'll go back to my regular scheduled everything. In fact, I'll probably be doing more. But I just wanted to jump on real quick and uh, let everybody know. Um, so... For the upcoming paper pumpkin, I'm sorry, my printer pr cut everything off, but this is the kit that we're going to be getting um, in this month for October. Um, the last day to register for this is going to be um, the 10th of October, and this is uh, $24.50 a month. Now, if you don't want to subscribe, then you can do um, a prepaid uh, prepaid is $23.50 for one month, uh, $69.50 for three months, $127 for six months, and $243 if you want to purchase the whole year in advance. Um, now that's not including tax. It is include the, the price does include shipping. Um, this is a new kit that just became available today called, again, my computer or my printer cut this up. It's called Rustic uh, Christmas. It's kind of like a, um, almost like a advent calendar, but I think you can hang it on your tree. Um, it, you can put little treats in the envelopes here that you can see. And then <coughs> the biggest promotion for this month is going to be the, um, it's 35 off or 35 more on the starter kit. Um, if you're not familiar with Stampin' Up!, um, Basically, you can join my team, and what that means is you can, if you want to be a demonstrator, you can sell um, or purchase up to $300 every three months, or you can, um, you know, you can do it just for this deal and then drop. It's, it's really totally up to you. If you do continue on and keep up with the 300 minimum uh, every three months, you will get a 20% discount. And if you go farther, you can go up to uh, 25%. But what the promotion is this month, I, I made sure I wrote it down so I wouldn't mess it all up, but you can either get 35% off the starter kit, which means that you would get $125 in product for $64.35 free shipping, or you can get 35% more on the starter kit, and that's 35% more product, which is $168.73 of product for only $99 with free shipping. Um, again, if you have any questions about this, leave a comment below and ask me, and we can do a one-on-one. -on -one. I can call you, or we can do an email, or whatever. I really... Um, you know, I'd love to have you on my team if you want to join. Um, so the reason why I wanted to jump on here, you know, we offer really cute kits. A lot of my friends have been reaching out to me and saying, Jody, I don't know even where to start. If I wanted to help you with your business, I don't even know where to start. Kits are perfect for that. This is in the one of the kits collection. It's not the new one because I have to order that one, but this is called Festive Tags, and we're going to put this one together real quick today. So this is how it comes in the box, and of course you can always reuse the box. <coughs> I'm sorry for coughing. I, I finally have got a doctor's appointment in the morning. I've been so sick I can't like yesterday I couldn't hardly do anything we had to go for our makeup test yesterday and I about died through that thing I, I I was so ready to go it took like two hours for me and my daughter and I was ready to go I didn't like cough in the lady's face but I kept feeling like I was going to she paused enough for me to not cough in her face but okay so it looks like we get some twine some dimensionals and some um, bling. I'm going to put these to the side because I know we won't need that. Um, here is the different tags. Now this is a non-stamping set, um, so you don't need anything to put this together at all. 
unless you want to use like a different adhesive. I probably will because I don't like those little dot things that they generally give you, but um, I don't know what's in this kit. So I'm just taking all the tags out. Most of the time with our kits, they give you extras to do other things with if you want. Um, I should line these up so I don't have to sort them out later. Okay. I love the kits. It's like, especially the tags. They're my, I love doing tags. I always make my own Christmas tags. Um, but you can use these for more than that. You could actually put these on a gift if you wanted, or you could put them on like a treat box if you wanted. It's, you know, really up to you. But I think I love doing my own tags. I make a lot of them for my craft fairs too and sell them. I haven't got around to making a lot this year, so my customers are going to be upset about that one. But um, I've been so busy. Almost got everything popped out. I like the colors of this too. It's not just regular red and green. So a lot of times when you um, go and buy Christmas gifts, um, you know, the paper is going to be what's on trend. And Stampin' Up! is usually pretty good about hitting the trends with the colors. So whatever wrapping paper you pick, I'm sure this will, you can find one to match these tags if you're picky about it. Some people don't care, but I think when you're a creative, you pay attention to those details. Not everybody does, but okay, I'm going to leave. It looks like these are stickers, so I'm going to leave these. This we won't need. And this is the directions. I'm going to run and grab my glasses real quick and I'll be right back. gotta try and hurry because I got a guy coming by to look at my hot tub. I've been trying to sell this hot tub for a month now and people keep telling me they're coming and then they don't come and it's kind of annoying. Okay, I'm just sorting out the different ones. I bought up quite a few kits because I um, I knew I would be a little bit behind, but I had no idea I would, was going to deal with getting sick and really fall behind. I mean, I am behind, behind. I haven't got anything done that I thought I was going to do. Okay, so I don't know if you guys are one of those that follow directions exact, but I usually just look at the picture and wing it. But Okay, so the first one we're doing is this one. And looks like this goes here and then for you. So you just stick this on here, just like, oop, I want it even. I'm picky about that. Pop it down just like that. And then your dimensionals will go on the back to pop up your Christmas bulb. Trash can closer a little bit. Okay. And then it looks like we're going to layer that on here. And so right here it says that you need to cut eight and a quarter inches from here. I always have problems finding the end on these. Oh, maybe that's it. Okay. So I'm going to grab my ribbon scissors real quick. Eight and a quarter. That looks good. 
then you're going to double it up just like this. Poke it through the loop in through and then push this through the loop. And that's the first one. And then you can, um, if you have stamps, you could go ahead and stamp to and from on the back of here. Uh, you would do that before you did this, um, but you just tie this onto your bow. So that's the first one. The second one is this with the snowman. I love snowman. And looks like they have popped this one up. Put one more in the middle there so it doesn't sag. Okay, and then they used Be Merry. And there's a couple different languages on here, so um, you just have to find yours. There, and then it's this stripe, and you're going to do the same thing. Cut the eight and a quarter inches. Poke it through the little hole. Okay, and there's tag number two. What did I do with the first one? Oh, here it is. Tag number two. Flip it over here. This is the third one. Let me find it. It's not that, not that. Oh, no, that's not the right one. Okay, it's this, and do I have one hidden somewhere? And that, oops, that, the stripe, oh, here, right here, this one. Okay, this one, you get the Merry Christmas. Where's that? Be Merry. Oh, it's two words. That's why. Merry Christmas. Okay. Put this on here. And then pop a dimensional on the back. I'm going to put them here because that way I, they don't hang over. Put that on there. And then you grab this little red piece. And do the same thing with the eight and a quarter inches. The loop. And there is the third one. Okay, so the fourth one, somebody's hollering at me. Oh, I hope that's not the guy. Hold on one second, let me make sure.
Okay, let me see. I am back. I am so sorry, everybody, but I've been trying to sell this hot tub for a while, and the guy came a little bit sooner than I thought. But I wanted to finish what I was doing. Let me see. I think we're on. Okay. Again, I'm so sorry about that. I, I've been trying to sell my hot tub. It's in my garage and I need it out of there. <laughs> I can't move around out there without it moved. Okay, so the next one we're doing is with this gold and then the word joy and this reef. And I don't know if you can tell, but this is foil. The little specks on there is foiled and I love that. I, I love little details like that. So you want to line this up where you think you want to put it. Place your joy down. And then where are my dimensionals? Uh, I am losing it. Let me see if they're underneath my keyboard. Nope. with them. <coughs> Make sure they put them in the box. Nope. Alright, well, that's okay. I have... Here they are. So for this one, I think I'm going to cut this in half because it looks like that's kind of skinny right there. put a full one down here these tags are so cute like so for all my friends out there that want to help support my business this is definitely a kit for you because you don't I know everyone buys Christmas gifts and I know you all wrap them and you don't have to stamp so there's really no mess up to this. It's an easy kit. And it's something you're going to buy anyway, so you might as well do your own. And if you have kids, this would be a fun thing to do. Like sometimes I know people have little traditions they do. And if you come from a crafty family, this would be a good thing. Um, my old boss that I worked with at the hospital, her sisters all get together during the holidays and they make some kind of a craft kit every year. So this would be a perfect thing to start with your family. If you, Stampin' Up! does this every year, usually a tag set. Now, I'm not gonna say that every year you don't have to stamp, but um, this year they made it to where you don't. So there is the fourth tag. Let's see. Where's my directions? I don't even know how many there are in here. I didn't even pay attention. Oh, I actually did that on the... So this one went on the pink, but it still matches, so I'm going with it. Well, I could change it, because see how easy it is to change it out? If you, you, you don't have to make this exactly how the kit directions say you can change things if you want and it still will coordinate and look cute but I'm going to change it for some of you that think it has to be that way for most of us creative people we try to do it different but it's a tag it doesn't matter okay so this this one and the Christmas tree and then this big blue tag I think this is the last one. Let me see. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Yep, this is the last one. All right. So we're going to put Noel on here. Let's put some. 
some dimensionals on the back. Got that dimension on the back of there. Whoops. Okay, so I normally post on or do videos on Mondays and Thursdays. I'm still going to try and do Thursday's video, but I can't promise. Um, I, like I said, I'm doing everything for the wedding and I'm just, I'm so far behind on that. Um, I'm going to the doctor tomorrow for this cough and hopefully I can get some medicine or something because it's been awful. But this is the... Festive Tag Kits. Um, I think this is $19 for this kit. I think I looked that up. Um, and if you, um, this can also go towards, if you watch me, I do the, um, if you use my host code, which that's linked in the featured section up above this live feed. If you look up at the very top, it should be up there. If you place a $35 order, you can also get a free card kit So, um, this week. So, hi, Barbara. I'm going to send your... I'm going to look at... As soon as I get done with this video, I'm going to look up your... Um, to make, I, I think I, I thought I sent... I thought that was the uh, PDF I sent you, but I think I might have sent the wrong one. I don't know. I'm going to look and see. But anyways, that's this tag kit, and that's all for this week. I, like I said, I'm going to try and do a video on Thursday. I'll do better next week, or I mean, once this wedding is over with. I have so much to do with that. We're supposed to help her move this week, but um, I'm not going to go because I um, had already committed to doing a presentation for um, our, my team on Saturday, so I can't go. Um <laughs> I um, also want to encourage everyone to register for World Car Making Day. It is a free event. Even if you don't purchase the bundles that go along with that. Um, oh, okay, Barbara. Um, even if you don't uh, have the bundles that go with that, it is a free car making class. And you can use whatever you have to, you know, get card ideas and um if you're not on my um, email list, you can also join that in the featured section right above at the very top. It'll be the one of the first. If you scroll through, um, you can join there. So that's all for today. I will see you guys hopefully on Thursday. But if not, don't hold it against me. I'm sorry for not being so consistent as normal. Thanks. Bye-bye.